YouTube, what is going on? My name is Kevin, AKA The Tech Ninja. And if you're like me, you wish the Google Talk and the messaging application would be one big happy app family. You can swipe between SMS and Google Talk. Well, you can't do that yet, but there is something that you can do, which is just as cool. There's an application and it's called Sliding Messaging. And what it does, it allows you to swipe between your conversations using SMS, like so. So you can control your swipes with different speeds. For example, if I swipe to the left very slowly, it takes me to all my conversations. And if I swipe to the right very slowly, it takes me to a new conversation. So there are different controls that you can do just by gesturing. And also if you go into settings, you can adjust the gesture controls from here as well. Um, there's different themes, there's different styles of quick reply, there's emoji support, um, you can turn off the contacts, you can turn off notifications, adjust them all from this application right here. This application is still in beta, it's still a newer app, so you may have forced closes and things like that. However, to me, it's been very stable, and this is my daily driver for text messaging. There's one drawback from the application, and I feel I have to say it, it does not do MMS support. So if you're a heavy MMSer, you cannot use this application and get access to those messages. So you should still keep your backup messaging application, and when MMS comes through, go to the backup application and access it that way. Other than that, this application is very nice, it's very smooth, it uses the Android guidelines for building applications, so you can expect a smooth experience. And that's about it, guys. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them below. And once again, this app is made by Clink Dog from XDA Developers. And that is it. Thanks, guys. Have a good night.